Hi everyone and welcome back to our channel. Today we are in Wapping and we are going to the oldest riverside pub in London. Created circa 1520. We are at the Prospect of Whitby. Now this pub is right on the River Thames and when I mean right on the River Thames, take a look at this, right on the River Thames. Unbelievable views. Canary Wharf over there. Looks amazing. The pub itself, can't get any closer, can it? Now this pub has a bit of a checkered history. Once upon a time, it was known as the Devil's Tavern, mainly because of the people used to drink in here. A few naughty characters, I would have thought. The thing was called the Pelican, and obviously, they changed it to the Prospect of Whitby, which was named after a uh, boat, which was moored just, just behind me. Now, I've got to say I'm a bit nervous about doing the review here. I don't know if you can see the noose there. I hope I'm not going to be hanging from there a bit later on. As always, let's give it a go. Okay, before I get to the menu, I've got to say, this pub is like a TARDIS. It's got an upstairs level, a downstairs level, two uh, balcony bars. It's got a restaurant off on the side, and I'm in the smuggler's bar. <laughs> got to say, what a traditional feel, brass top tables, beautiful, beautiful pub, absolutely beautiful. Onto the menu. It's got steak and alpine, sirloin steaks, burgers, lighter options, so you can have a sirloin steak to your batter. Lovely selection of desserts as well. Today, I'm gonna to go for their 28 day aged sirloin steak and have it medium rare. It comes with triple cooked chips, vine tomatoes and onion rings, and I'm going to have a peppercorn sauce with that. Got to say, really nice menu. But what is brilliant is this whole pub. Truly amazing. See you shortly. Everything here is authentic. Got my steak, comes with the chips, the onion rings, fine tomatoes. It's a little bit greedy. I've got myself some beef dripping gravy, only an extra pound. Comes with the peppercorn sauce as well. I've decided to get myself a half of their best bitter because they've got the name on it. Let's try that. Very nice. Nice range of uh, real ales downstairs as well. So, let's try one of their triple cooked chips. Mm. 
Very nice, crispy on the outside, really soft in the middle. Try with a bit of the gravy. Oh, that's nice. Mm. Onion rings look really crisp. Mm. You heard the crispness of that. Onto the steak. Now, how is this steak cooked? Ask for it medium rare. Nice charring on top. Real beefy flavor there. 28 day aged. Definite 28 day aged. Try it with the peppercorn sauce. Oh, that's really thick. Mm. Really peppery. Real thick sauce. Go try it with this beef dripping gravy as well. Tomatoes actually aren't cooked. The vine tomatoes, they've got a lovely sweetness to them. Let's give everything a go. Oh. Mm. Very nice. Let's try some of this. You can see the little bits of beef dripping in there as well. Gotta say that's really nice real deep flavor to it. I'm gonna really enjoy this. I'll see you in a minute. Okay, that was one enjoyable meal. Steak itself, slightly overcooked. I'd say it was nearer medium than medium rare. Didn't affect the flavor. Still very tender, nice charring on top as well. Triple cooked chips. Nice and crunchy on the outside, soft in the middle. Unfortunately, the vine tomatoes, they were not cooked, but had a nice sweetness to them, cut through uh, the whole meal and, and, and brought it all together. Onion rings were crunchy. You heard the crunch earlier on, they were really crunchy. Peppercorn sauce, very thick, very peppery. Enjoyed that. Beginning to really, really like the beef dripping gravy. Had it a few times now, and that's becoming a firm favorite of mine. Got to say the staff here are very attentive. The staff are very, very good. Price-wise, $18.95. Oh, and a pound extra for the peppercorn sauce. Sorry, the beef dripping sauce. Beyond value, beyond good value. <clears throat> it's an easy nine out of 10. If you're in Wapping, if you're not in Wapping, come down to Wapping, got to give this pub a try. Even if it's just for a drink, the food is fantastic. The star of the show is the pub itself. It is amazing. So many different bars, nice restaurants to the side, seating overlooking the Thames. Couldn't ask for any more. I'm going to take a look around here in a minute and, and show you what this pub's 
all about and what it's really like. If you could like and subscribe to our channel, I'd really appreciate that. Until next time, cheers. The beer's pretty good as well. <laughs>